you're down here in the IMAX screen of Godzilla minus one. So are you ready? I am ready indeed. Let's do it. I'm surprised how big the screen is. Look. Again, we saw on, on Oppenheimer on the biggest IMAX screening. So let's watch it. And you can, like, you know what I noticed? You can see the IMAX 30, 65 or 75 millimeter in the back. That's a huge bitch! So we got back from watching Godzilla minus one. And I can't describe how great this movie was. Mm -hmm. I won't, like I said, I won't go into spoilers because pretty much it's a reimagining of the 1954 film. But yeah. But let's take a look at the posters. Since some posters do have changes. Let's do it. So we got Michael Mann's Ferrari starring Adam Driver. And I'm gonna see this movie because guess who's making it? Michael Mann. <laughs> We already seen, uh, we already saw that poster. There's more over here. I'm not too sure I'm gonna see this because look who's directing it. But yeah, let's look at that. But I'm surprised Godzilla had a budget of, a budget of $15 million. I'm like, it just goes to show you how much Marvel is doing so poorly with their films. Say all I can say is probably the MCU is already dead. Yeah, feel like superhero just, movies are dead at this point. I would tell people this that MCU should stop at Endgame. This is what I'm saying like, Endgame should have been the last Marvel movie, but Godzilla minus one is a definition of cinema. Alright, let's look at the ones. King of the Planet of the Apes. I'm not too sure if I'll see this because this is another series that. But, what? But of course, uh, let me get a close it. 20th Century Studios. Wrong!
other Disney it's movies. This might not do well at the box office, just like other Disney properties. From the director of Bullet Train. I actually really enjoy that movie. But it's gonna be an IMAX. And the studio my itself. Universal Studios, but you know what's funny? This is released during my birthday, March 1st. I don't, I'm not too sure if I'm gonna like this movie. And I have another movie that uh, I'm too I'm not interested <laughs> because this is this guess what actress is starring in this movie? It's great, yeah. I'm not interested. I know it's written by the person who made uh, Jennifer's Body. Oh yeah, that's right. Yeah, but no, I'm not interested in watching that movie. I'm good. But I can't describe how great Godzilla minus one. And keep in mind, we saw this in IMAX. Just like what we did with Oppenheimer. Yeah. Like you can see that in the water. Yeah, I won't lie. I would, my legs were shaking from how my, Godzilla acted. In I this feel movie. like my body almost trembles. Like the every moment. I you know what? I'll give this a movie a credit. This movie has one of the best cinematography and shot compositions for a monster movie. I won't go into spoilers, but let's just say that some scenes where Godzilla is rampaging through the city just made me look, reminded me of the Roland Emmerich's disaster movie, Godzilla. But what was your, wait, you know what, and on top of that, what's our first Godzilla movie? Mine was the 1998 Zilla, I'm not going to call it Godzilla. But yeah, but you know what? what? I'll give something about Godzilla minus one. Is that this is a Godzilla that is not afraid to destroy a building. This is some this. You guys have to see this on IMAX. I recommend to everyone Yeah, because we how much are, was our ticket like twenty bucks? Yeah. Oh yeah, and here's another movie that I was going to see, but that's not happening anymore because we have a problem. We were going to see the bike riders, but unfortunately, Fox, uh, Disney is not is not making this movie or distri distributing the movie. What a waste! Because instead, uh, it's going to go to what is it? Focus, uh, uh, focus, focus Reels. Features. Yeah. Yeah. Focus Features. So essentially, the uh, production company, uh, I can't see their name. Well, I will say it. It's Ray, Ray, uh, Ray, Z. Ray Z. Yeah, Ray Z. They're, they're, they're basically providing the, the production cost, but Disney is not, are no longer distributing it. For what reason? I have no idea. I was gonna see it, but I was gonna see, and this was the original release date. Right now, it's, now, it should be out now, but we don't know unfortunately, it's Disney are so greedy. We don't know what it's gonna. Be. And this is why Disney should not bought Fox. Meanwhile. That looks insane though. I keep forgetting you're finding the Joker, aren't you? Yeah. yeah. 
I'm taking off Scarecrow Saint. All right. Oh, okay. You have to shoot all of them. I know. I mean, I've played this game before. All right. I got it. One more, yeah, one more left. Turn left. I'm looking at him. Yeah. Turn left. You got it. I stopped straight from the cross. Mission complete. Oh, you're flying. We gotta destroy these. That's all, folks.